Hey guys, this is Night Fury, and yes, I am back. Uh, how did you guys enjoy the uh, AFA montage? And yes, it was pretty crowded, but it's fun. Yeah, it was my first AFA. So let's not delay any further, and let's review the DX Forze driver. So yeah, as you guys can see the front, we have Kamen Rider Forze and the Forze driver, and the tiny astronaut guy. So yeah. We have the rocket switch, launcher switch, the rail switch, and the radar switch. Radar. It comes with four astro switches. Four astro switches. Three, two, one, and zoom. So yeah, uh, Bandai over here, and the Forze logo over here, and the Toei Company logo over here. So let's take a look at the end top. On the top, I mean. So yeah, so here we have. For Astro Switch for Z Driver. So here we have Rocket Switch, Launcher Switch, the Rail Switch, and the Radar Switch. It comes with lights and sounds. DX for Z Driver. Henshin device. So yeah, let's take a look at the bottom. So at the bottom it says For Astro Switch for Z Driver. DX for Z Driver. Henshin device. So here is the one, the left side of the Forza driver, and the Forza driver with all the switches that is available in this product. So let's take a look at this side, the left side. So here we have the four Austro switch Forza driver, engine device DX Forza driver. Here we have the circle side, cross side, triangle side, and the square side. Kind of like this. PlayStation controller, huh? PlayStation controller. So yeah, let's take a look at the other side. On this side, yeah, the box is already kind of opened. Um, for for Z drive for for Z driver. <laughs> Just kidding. For Astro Switch for Z driver. Henshin device DX for Z driver. Here we have Common Rider for Z floating in space, and all the Astro switches coming out like this. So. And the Forza driver. Let's take a look at the back. So as you can see here, this is the Forza driver and the four switches available. It comes with four switches, the Astro switches, I mean, the instruction manual and the Henshin device. Here, step one, put in all the Astro switches, flip the red color things and and then like rocket, launcher, drill, radar. It goes according to colors. <laughs> so yeah, LED lights. Next, we hench it into Forza by three, two, one. Henshin, Kamen Rider Forza no Henshin desu. Hi, squeezeしますね. And here we have Kamen Rider Forza. LED seven kinds of lights available in this product. So number two, we have the um, Astro Switch module. Activate. So you click a rocket, you can activate the rocket. Rocket on. So yeah, um, just gotta click the module, the switches to activate the modules, like the rocket module over here. And number three, he starts to limit the brick, rocket, drill, hit the lever, rocket on, blah 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 blah, blah. limit the breaker, like the rocket to do the kick. No, so yeah, and number four, last but not least, you can collect the switches in many other ways, such as the food droids, burger meal, the candy toys, Astro Switch one rocket. Or the Gashapon, which is the way I'm gonna get it. The switches. So yeah, and you can put the mysterious switches into the Forza driver, rocket, launcher, derail, radar. Or into the Gumbarai machine. Length of the belt, I think. If I'm not wrong, I don't read Japanese. And last but not least, we have Bandai Asia. Check us out at BandaiAsia.com So that's about it. Um... That's about it. Okay, let's so let's take a look at the inside of the product, shall we? 
So now that we have the item out of its packaging, let's take a look at the item itself. So when you take it out of this box, you have this giant sheet of wood or cardboard. And here we have the pamphlet and the instruction manual, which I haven't even read yet. So let's now take a look at that. So here we have the four day driver itself. Um, let's take it out of its packaging, shall we? So yeah, let's now that we have taken it out of its packaging, let's take a look at the details first. Then we'll go to the sounds. So let's put the Astro switches one side first, and we'll take a look at the details of the bell. Awesome. So here we have the bell itself. Let's take a look. So here we have the thing that holds the belt together. I mean the belt strap, something like that. It's really, I guess, well detailed. I can't say much about this thing. So yeah, let's move on to the strap. So this is the left side of the strap. Looks like a very ordinary strap and it's well detailed. Black dots. Translucent plastic. Not very transparent. And here we have the rough and smooth surfaces. This is the smooth part. This is the rough part. It looks really awesome with the L sign. Stands for loser. No, I'm just kidding. It stands for left. Haha, <laughs> joker. So yeah. Here we have the right side of the bell. Very nicely detailed. And here we have the black dots again and the translucent plastic. And here we have the rough and smooth surfaces. Smooth and rough. And the R sign stands for... I have no idea. No, I'm just kidding. It stands for right. So yeah, um, now let's take a look at the belt. There's a lot of details on the belt. So here first we have, you can see the little guy in the middle. It's actually Forze. And yeah, uh, we have this black color screen that catches a lot of thumbprints easily. And here we have the details. It's really nice. And yeah, it looks really nice. Cool, cool, cool and such. Yeah, it looks really nice. And then here we have the things inside yeah circle cross triangle and square so yeah actually the rough and smooth surfaces runs everywhere take a look at here there's rough and smooth surfaces here too really nicely detailed and yeah really nicely detailed it looks really awesome and at the back the battery compartment and a lot of smooth and rough surfaces. The rough surfaces have shiny, shiny things on it. I mean, glittery, glittery. So yeah, it looks really cool and such. I wish I could focus it. There focus. we go. See, the rough side, shiny, shiny. And then yeah, it looks really, really awesome. And yeah, and here is the on and off switch. The cross stands for off, circle stands for on. There we go. And then we have this funny, funny pattern over here. So yeah, now let's take a look at the Astro switches, shall we? Here we have the Astro Switch 01. Rocket switch. So yeah, it's orange. It's circle, circle. So they can go inside the 4 day driver. And it's a rocket logo. Glittery, glittery rocket logo. Clicking on, clicking on. There we go. And below you can see click, click. There we go. Next we have the launcher switch. Blue color and it's a cross. So you can put inside the fuzzy driver. Really nicely detailed. And we have the glittery, glittery launcher logo. There we go. Okay, next we have the drill switch, yellow, triangular to fit into the Forza driver, and very nicely detailed. And we have the glittery drill logo, and the switch, the lever I mean. There we go, and last but not least, we have the radar switch. Radar, I mean. Radar switch. Totally black. 
it's a square the fin said for the driver and it has a glittery radar logo which is kind of hard to see there we go glittery 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 and you can flip it flip it flip it flip it flip it and then there we go yeah so now that we have taken a look at the details let's um, take a look at the sounds shall we so let's put in some batteries into this thing shall we batteries so now that we have put the batteries inside let's take a let's turn it on shall we and yes let's hope the light there we go and as you can see you can see for the over there and let's put in the switches Dorello. Radar. So let's engine, shall we? Let's click these things. The engine sequence goes for three times. Maximum three times. Hit him. So yeah, we have pensioned. So let's take a look at the sound, shall we? So yeah, let's hear the sounds again. So let's do the rider rocket drill kick, shall we? It's a combination of the rocket and drill switches. Limit to break. And now that we've done with all the sounds, let's try out the item that we got in Metal Set SP. So yeah, this is the magic hand switch. Why is it called Magic Hand? Well, last week during the CS Toys, uh, the alternative show, Mr. X explained that the Magic Hand switch is actually named after a very traditional thing. So yeah, um, it, in Japan when they were small and it was years ago, they had this grabbing toy thing to grab things from far away. It's just a toy, and they usually call it like the magic hand so it's kind of like magic so yeah um it's a really unique name i must admit so let's try out in the forza driver shall we so let's try it out it's circle magic hand limit break So now that we have done with the review of almost everything, um, almost every aspect, uh, I hope you guys really enjoyed this review as I've been really preparing for this because this is like the big thing for my channel this year. So yeah, um, I really hope you guys enjoyed this. More reviews to come really soon. I guess like I'll do it like once a week, every week, one review, one or two reviews at least. So yeah. Um, about that, uh, I already got some of the stuff. If you, if you guys add me on my Night Relax Kamen Rider 
uh, account you, you you can get like preview stuff of what I got recently and etc so yeah um so now that we've done with the review so I guess I have to sign out now huh <laughs> yeah so I really hope you guys enjoyed this review comment uh, favorite like this video if you guys really want add me as a friend if you're a stranger and if you really like my reviews subscribe I am not gonna force you to do anything so yeah um, it's your move so yeah um, now that we've come to the end of the video uh, this is Night Fury and the 4Z driver signing out so yeah now we have the item out of the box now here we have the thing the product so yeah um, here is the tiny pamphlet and the instruction manual which I haven't even opened yet so yeah, um, it's together with this tiny slit of wood. So yeah, um, so we have the 4Z driver over here. Take it out. Sweet. Wow, epic fail. Uchu, kita!